Because somehow when we come together to celebrate life and love, marriage, something happens. Because collectively we think about those beautiful things. And then we shift in consciousness. And when a group shifts together in consciousness, I say something magical is happening. Wash over me, let me fall from my surroundings. Take over me, I'm a river rushing memory. If only for a moment, oh, this could be my last chance. Of course, love, your love, it doesn't start at this moment. It has started a long time ago. There's that beautiful reading when I speak about love that you've also chosen. And I think it summarizes unconditional love perfectly. It says love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, and it keeps no record of wrongs. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. When in doubt at any time along this journey called married life, touch with the hands so that you can feel the other person. Because when we know there's someone else in a relationship, it helps with seeing things slightly differently. Because you are two unique individuals, each with your own very life and light and essence and presence and the way how you perceive your life and how you would like to live it, look at it, express it, be part of it. And that makes you really uniquely you. So it's my hope that you will go through this life very mindful, aware, conscious of who you are. Keeping that life and light burning inside of you all the time, becoming who you are meant to be. And at the same time enjoy the union, the power of this union that we are celebrating with you. I truly believe that love is the glue that keeps everything together. It's big, it's profound, it's holy. And we have that within us. Seek that, nurture it, take care of it within yourselves, in one another and as a couple.
that Mitch and Tanya here present have been married. And you may seal this commitment with a kiss. <laughs> Most importantly, to Tanya. Today marks the start of a new adventure, one where we call ourselves husband and wife. They say opposites attract, and I would say that is what attracted me to you. While I am the quieter and more reserved person, you balance me with your energetic character and bubbly personality. Tanya, I love you with the bottom of my heart. <laughs> 